Hello everybody, welcome to game number nine, I believe, of Error BB. I've literally got no idea what week it is. I'm going to say nine and then check his record. It is nine, he's got chaos, so his record isn't too surprising. Uh, he's got nothing, right? Well, the strength of Beastman's pretty good. But, you know, it's just, they're, just, they're so far behind skill-wise, they just get nothing. They're, they're slow to skill and they're already behind the curve. Meanwhile, Dells are ahead of the curve. And, <laughs> and put themselves even further ahead. So there you go. So this should be an easy win. Um, but, you know, he might get lucky with removals and stuff. Uh, that certainly happens. That certainly happened to me before more than a few times. So, you know, we'll see. We'll see what happens. I've got a journeyman, 130k in the bag. If I had 140, I might have bought two elves. But, um... There's absolutely no point buying one, is there? So he's gone for a wizard and a bribe. That's anti-social, isn't it? It's about 40k of his own money to buy a bribe. Flip me. Flip me. Outrageous. Outrageous. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I should be avoiding the win. That is the way to play. Um, shall we receive an attacker? Yep. Let's receive an attacker. Right. This guy getting to 31. Uh, this guy wants to score right to get to 16. He wants to get one for MVP, he wants to get one. He wants to get three. He's on five. He could just wait for an MVP. I don't know. So he scores. He gets three, four, five completions. Seems low impact though, doesn't it? Line all skills. Five, six. I don't know. Daka, daka. And hopefully he'll just score, right? If I defensive Daka, he would just score, and then it could be a 1-1, one, one and I could get more. A 2-1 win, then. Oh, he's got a wizard. Oh, I probably should have kicked, actually. I forgot he had a wizard. But also he's got a bribe, so this lets me avoid the bribe a bit. Oh, yeah, of course. Yeah. Mm. So the pom's just led me taking more casualties probably so far. Yeah, it's it's been on, Pogba. It's just that the first round wasn't streamed. There's been six matches in the second round. I didn't just wanted to bash them because obviously I'm not exactly keen on doing them. <laughs> I'm not exactly keen on doing them. So... I was batching them. Dimrath. Our Lord and Saviour, Dimmy G, hello. Dimmy, 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 he streams after midnight. Strats. Yeah, it's a good point, Pedro. It's a very good point. As I say, if I had 140k, I would have bought two elves so that I could have done just that. Okay. Glorious. No, I won't give in until I'm victorious. And I will defend. 
I will defend. 5,292 rats WHER born from the same mother in the time I was subscribed to you. Wow. Thank you very much, Mr. Yemadan. That's a lot of rats. That's a lot of rats. Thank you very much. Absolutely glorious. YouTube into gym. I don't understand what that means, but... Yeah. I've just been so fucking obsessed with rats that you're about to go on I holiday. I did. Yeah, I've already done the you, intro. And yeah. like, you're kind of you not paying Fortnite attention with the team. Uh, tsk, tsk. Tsk. I play more fucking rats. What the fuck? Why the fuck would anyone play that much fucking rats? Jesus Christ. Yeah, the glorious music was amazing, but it um, but it it got me demonetized <laughs> too many times. And I thought, who cares? I nearly declared a pass there, I've been playing too much fumble. Right. I mean, I might not score, so maybe I should concentrate on getting the completions first. Well, I can spread them between the two of them. Never, never re-roll. It's just because I've got the extra one. I thought I'd do it. Hello, Dimmy. I mean, fingers crossed I can lose 3-0, yeah. Fingers crossed I can lose 3-0. But uh, no, I'm trying to put it oh, I put fantastic advice in the title. I was going to try and play optimally, wasn't I? Obviously, that isn't optimal <laughs> for winning the game, but for for winning the for winning the league, it's optimal, right? To try for these vanity passes. Um, Alor Sata, yep, back to normal. Um, so yeah, obviously the Daka run everyone back. Um, that means he can't beat me up. I mean, actually, I've got a Pommer and he's only got Mighty Blow, but he, he does have a, a bribe, so he's getting gang fouls if he wants. And obviously, this lets me maximise SPP, the Daka. Against a Wizard, it's a bit dodgy, right? It is a bit dodgy against a Wizard, to be fair. But um, also, it's chaos, so I'm not really bothered about anything they've got. <laughs> I'm not really bothered about anything they've got or anything they can do. <laughs> So there you go. Um, yes, I mean, because I might double one uh, Kalon, and a dodge Lino is rubbish <laughs> and completely expendable, and a dodge Blitzer is really, 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 really good. Yeah, simple as that. Simple as that. Like, one in 36 has happened, right? If I if I double one the dodge, he gets gang fouled into like death, probably right. <laughs> I've played this game before. He gets gang fouled into death. I had I had dodge on the lino. The lino had dodge. The lino had dodge. It was just it was this dodge lino was on the other. Flicky, <laughs> which <laughs> which to be fair. <laughs> Uh, you know, letting Flicky do anything, trusting Flicky to do literally anything, is, uh, is you know, you can argue that's a mistake. But, uh, is what it is. quite like that he's not going wide. Maybe it's because I haven't gone wide. He hasn't gone wide, so I'm not going to go wide next turn, even though I'd normally like to go wide next turn, a little bit wide next turn. I think I'm not going to go wide next turn to encourage him to also not go wide next turn. Tanks, Dimmy. Look at me getting into the... Getting into the, getting into the Irish League spirit there. 
I was role playing as an Irish lad on uh, on Fumble. You know, I people said, you know, well played and that, and I said thanks. <laughs> <laughs> I was very proud of myself. Oh, cheers, kid. Okay, I'll do that in the future. So obviously the better place to hit from here, right, and get an additional hit. Um, however, I want to stay as central as possible. And I don't want to go... First of all, I want to stay as central as possible with the palm so I can hit in it, blitz in any direction. But second of all, I do want to keep this. Uh... Seeing as he didn't go wide, I also don't need to go wide. Hey, he gets his level. Ooh. Yes, Timmy, that's true. But if I attempt eight passes, I'll probably make, uh, you know, five or six, which is better than scoring a touchdown. They are funny Irish celeb names. Terry Wogan, I know. Tommy Tina, I know. I know Mike Murphy, I'm friends with him. <laughs> They're the only ones I know. <laughs> Fail passes don't make you win the game, exactly. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> you may know a few Mike Murphys, yeah? <laughs> <laughs> Mick and Steve and then Paddy's their dad <laughs> yep yep We've got a witch elf surf here, unless this this lad gets blitzed. Blitz? Could also surf this one. It's harder, isn't it? Be double G if I'm... Well, hey, Dodge doing things again. Frustration reroll, maybe? No. Disciplined. So I wanted to subtly move more players over this side in an attempt to break through here next turn. And I guess I've got to, I've got to break through this way, or through the centre, I guess. Through the centre is also good. As we've got the warriors aren't doing a whole lot. This guy's in the way, isn't he? I want somebody in there so I can 2D him. Oh, he's strength 4, that's pretty good actually. Going through here is amazing, but it just means a long hit. I guess that's what I've got to do. <laughs> it's 
Terry Wogan. See you later, mate. Guess we're buying this uh, journeyman. <laughs> Dead warrior. Alright, his apple. Apple stops him dying. Doesn't help him for the match. Alright, so we've got two players up there. Um, That was really risky, wasn't it? I realise I should probably do that first before I do the pass with a wizard. <laughs> Another double one. <laughs> God. So yeah, I mean that that was actually terrible, right? Terrible turn ordering because I just didn't. I just really wanted to do that pass, even though the pass was terrible, right? The pass was terrible um, in terms of you know playing optimally, winning the game. Really should have gone for this dodge first. Though obviously that dodge would have, well, I shouldn't have gone for the pass, right? I should have just moved him over here and then made this dodge. Thought it would have been a double one, but you know having getting some people up there would have been amazing. Really, what I could have done was... I still wanted this in case the wizard. I did want this guy in case the wizard. But yeah, this guy. Oh, wizard's come down. Not a problem at all. Wonderful. Not the best wizard you've ever seen. Nice re-roll. Thanks, Dimmy. Yep, both re-rolls have been ones. Powers me dodger. Diced again. Best he's probably gonna get is like a is a tackle zone on the ball. In which case we've got an edge five. Deal with it. And he used his wizard, so that's good. Maybe he wouldn't have used that wizard if it wasn't for the uh, failed. Is he going to go for the surf? He could do. This is one on the surface where it seems okay, right, to, to surf him, but wasting your blitz is probably not worth it. Probably lose a few blitz there. I mean, probably lost anyway, right? Probably lost this drive anyway. Especially if I was playing properly. <laughs> But, like, it's so weak and so easy to break through right now. Can't afford to spend a blitz over here. Two diced. So a bit unlucky there for another two tackle zones on the ball. And I should be able to hit him. If he gets the dodging in the pickup, then where can he go afterwards? He's leaving all the space. Oh, he's just going for the score. He's just going for the score. But if he if he rolls this, he he's he's looking pretty good. If he rolls the dice here, yeah, just go for the pass. Yeah, yeah, that's where he goes. This is the this is probably the right play. Oh, hand off the warrior. Okay, that's not the right play. 
Honestly, going for the lob in the end zone was probably the correct play there. I <laughs> nearly handed off the warrior anyway. Twice? Okay, now it's a long way away. Hmm. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, then pass. Okay, so we're okay. We're okay for ball recovery. <sighs> Makes it a bit fucking harder, doesn't it? Gotta make the blockless, the blockless loner block first. Pretty unlucky. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, one, two, three, four. Is it four diagonally? Maybe five diagonally. It's five diagonally. Let's hope it's five diagonally. Two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Give me SPP, God damn it. Thank you. Only base. So these two are relevant, so it's the, this one dodging for a two deep essentially. And either way, it's two. No, this is just one GFI, isn't it? Yeah, one's enough. Roll a one instead. Yeah, there was a lot of counting there, wasn't there? I didn't want her to get hit. Obviously, exposing the add five here sucks a bit. But he can't take advantage of that unless he's okay with losing the game. Which people tend to be overly concerned with. <laughs> so hopefully he'll do something vaguely caring about winning the match. Rather than trying to mercilessly destroy my best player. <laughs> Hello, unforgiven. Not bad, thanks. Dom-to-dom. -dom. That was weird. I felt like I had nobody left. I guess because of the stun and the wizard and stuff. But twice I've had to rely on a loner, which is not good, is it? 
<laughs> see, see how there's 11 concessions, but... Does indeed look like he's carrying about the ball. Who can say if that's good or bad? Instant one in nine. No sidesteppers yet, so I have to go to this guy. And the surface. Essential. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, for fuck's sake! <laughs> this has been a bit of a dicing, hasn't it? Feeling all my vanity passes. Hey, he's not dead, Kalon. He's not dead. He could have died. His apple, his apple half worked, right? It stopped him being dead. But I still had a real. He could have GFI one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So he can he can uh he can four three for a two D without tapping. Carpet Dimmy is a good name. I mean he's called it a shit health team and you've asked if it's got a natty kill on. <laughs> Were you, were you asking if his shit high elf team had a natty? <laughs> I mean, I don't think anyone's ever called a high elf team with a natty shit. Yeah, Demi, loads of skills. <laughs> no, I, I've got dark elves. <laughs> that's the that's the explanation. Got a pommer. <laughs> Got a pommer. Pretty hilarious. I think he's gonna go for a blitz. And a ball. Oh, he's not. He's just going for the witch elf. Which elf is he going for? <laughs> 
It could have been move nine. I mean, I was so close to taking the move eight as well. You told me, you told to take guard, Kalon. You suggested guard. Bunch of people suggested mighty blow. Like, obviously, I wanted to take mighty blow. But I did think movement was the best. The problem is, is like mighty blow tackle is the thing, right? To beat Elliot is, is like it gives me a high roll versus Elliot, whereas movement gives me the more likely. If I have movement nine and sidestep, but I mean I would need movement nine. Movement eight is is nothing. That's the problem. The problem is movement eight is nothing because uh, you know I'm just not going to be able to. Uh, I'm not going to be able to do anything with uh, movement. I can't pass this turn. Um, movement 8 doesn't make any difference versus Elliot. But movement... Uh, movement 9 would have given me a one turn chance. Because obviously you'll have loads of sidestep right Four. <laughs> Fucking die. <laughs> yes. All right, well, that's acceptable. Dead, dead, dead. Maybe I should have dodged him out one in nine first, but this was actually relevant, somewhat relevant positionally, right, to stop the, uh, to, to stop more, more protection for the bomber. Because <laughs> these guys are pretty relevant positionally. It's got three missing next game. So, hey, dodge protects him anyway. Good lad. He needs a completion to get to 11. That's a pretty good value completion, to be fair. If you should try to uh, score as well, it's like he really wants dodge, tackle, and jump up. <laughs> like he really wants to get five skills total. Dr. Funk. Seven Dyson. Which elf is getting blitzed? Oh, that one. <laughs> <laughs> I 
Get out of my house. I mean, I could surf, but I don't want to. What I want to do. Of course. Attempt to pass, which fails. And maybe I should have made um, this dodge first. Eh? <sighs> Thanks, Kalon. I've forgotten what I should say to be real. I'm really consistent, yeah. I've, it's been an awful, awfully consistent uh, ones in passing. Cheers, kid. <laughs> God, I can say I can call people kid and it won't even sound that bad because I'm fucking so old. I don't like that he's encouraged to blitz the guarder here. Ah, but he's not using block to do it. He's got extra arms, so he could blitz and try and pick up in tackle zones. <laughs> what has two thumbs in the tongue of uh, yeah. AI art is amazing, isn't it? Flip me. As like despicable as it is for actual artists. It's uh well, he has gone for the pickup. And the dodge away, but he can't he can't throw it or anything. Right, um, so I reckon the best way is the Witch Elf, right? Answer 1 in 36, but the extra hit. The 
is good. Oh, well, I guess it does mean following up. Which is bad. Not a problem. Right. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, I'm not going to try and pass this turn. <laughs> <laughs> Never in doubt. <laughs> Apart from all the ones passing it <laughs> and catching it. <laughs> oh, God. I ain't gone. Away. The old defensive Dakar. I guess we should cover this in just in case. So the question is whether to go for three nil or uh, two one or two nil. I guess. I mean, I'm not averse to a 3 0. It's down two players, including a warrior. See what happens in the LOS, I guess. 1 1 Dio win. I believe three to live out an assassin. Wow. Got to publish uh, the latest episode of Jeff Dewey, so I'm not going to do that. I love the X on the Oh, quick snap. The one turns on unless you're uh, unless you kill Bill. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> hey. <laughs> Sorry, would you prefer if I said you can one turn unless you're chalice winner, dog to the dog? Is that better? Way. <laughs> Not endorsed. <laughs> it was such a great moment, though, that you gave us. So thank you. <laughs> vanity passing high elves. Oh, I don't think so. Maybe vanity. Maybe vanity passing uh, pro elves. Right, pro elves are better at vanity passing because the blitzers have got the three plus. So vanity passing pro elves. 
pretty strong. Also, them vanity passing gets them DP sneaky get. Well, not the not the blitzers. Maybe the blitzers should take DP sneaky get. Assert dominance by not one turn. Maybe your opponent should have dacked here. That was the that was the problem. He got in quick and got two one grinded without. Really much fuss in the final. Obviously, there were some steps involved, but it's like basically, it's like uh, it's like the Battle of Waterloo, isn't it? They attacked in the same way, and we beat them in the same way, <laughs> and just uh, just miss out all of the details. Glorious. No, I won't give in. Glorious. Until I'm victorious. And I will defend. I will defend. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Thank you, Odunt, for staying fantastic for... You know, I can't do the maths. But 69. <laughs> He is rimming. <laughs> Thankfully. <laughs> He hasn't had much value from his bribe, has he? I must say. It's almost as if the Dak is a good is a good strategy, yeah? Who knew? Who knew this sorcery? Yeah, go on, I'll go for the three now. This one's super exposed, isn't he? This one is generally the one who gets blitzed. I mean, he can be as well, but then it's really stretching him thin. I'm an ass man. Oh my god, that's an amazing song. Fucking... Billy Gunn. <laughs> it's one of my favourite. I need to find out if I can get custom... Intros, right? I need to. I need to look into that. The modding of Two K Twenty Three. See if I can get custom, custom tracks for the entrances. I mean, that would be amazing. We could have Assman for Faulty. <laughs> Stuff like that. I could do them manually, but it's a pain in the ass. Extra arms. That's a, that's a feels bad man, isn't it? It's not as bad in a, in in this kind of format because you can then use him to skill up the other people, right? By passing to him. But um, like this warrior could pick it up and pass to him, and then he'll be able to catch it on a two plus. So like in a league where the results don't matter, two heads gets a bit of value. A little bit. It's uh it's a it's it's a it's a uh it's not eternal, it's three seasons of eleven games a season. And then there's a playoff at the end. But I mean it's, it suffers from all the problems of Blood Bowl leagues <laughs> of every Blood Bowl league ever. Yep. Except Funnily enough, uh, the Blood Bowl Super League, which I created. 
and got to the final every time, just quietly. I mean, the biggest problem is progression, isn't it? Like, that's that's ultimately... Like, that's why CCL was such a good format, really, trying to get the record at the same time as building the team. Yeah, I mean they've they've tried to mitigate it, but I mean it's still blood ball, right? Like, it's still seasonal near infinite blood ball. It's got a lot of problems. Well, Kahuna, thanks for the raid. And yeah, like that's. I mean, it's not it's not a knock on Era BB, is it? It's just blood ball, right? It's like it's the problem that every specialist games has had. Like every, you know, Necromunda, Mordheim, Woodball, any, anything like that with a progression. And progression is what causes the problems, isn't it? Well, you could have a playoff after every season, just quietly. That's what UKBBL did. I nearly won that in my first season, but... Uh, Bleeding hit me, diced the pants off me. I don't know if I've mentioned it ever. <laughs> he diced the flippin' bejesus out of me. I don't think I ever did. No, I probably didn't. Ah, oh, fair enough. Mike, how many people would make the playoffs? Like eight, and then that's four, two, one. It's still three weeks, isn't it? So then, like eleven weeks on and three weeks off is a bit shit for most people. So where's thirty-three weeks on and then like four or five weeks off? Isn't so bad, is it? Really want to obviously pile on this guy. That would be amazing, but I'm, I'm just not going to be able to pile on him. But we can send this guy around the back. Him with mighty blow. <laughs> oh, I'm so good at blood ball. What can I say? Together to trap the net with, with the good players as protected as possible. There's only three good players. He's the 13 guy, he's, he's in range, he's going to score in range in case something happens. It's pretty good strats, wasn't it? I called it and then it happened. I mean, that just shows it was good play. What can I say? <laughs> <laughs> Protecting the good players, yep. Hey, look, look, all done. I'm trying to help new players, okay? Trying to go back to the basics of what started the channel, you know, why I started playing when Blood Bowl 2 came out and everyone who streamed it was rubbish at Blood Bowl. No offence. 
and <laughs> to my eyes rubbish at streaming in terms of they didn't talk about what they were doing now in fairness it's like stripping and crendor right with the main ones well of course they didn't talk about what they're doing they weren't really streaming blood ball right they just they just stream no one's watching them for blood ball they're watching them for stripping and crendor and you know Kano his big uh, his big stream was like it's Kano right they're watching for Kano a bit of blood ball I mean he was obviously the best of them um, but he wasn't he wasn't as good as me at Blood Bowl, was he? Um, <laughs> and, you know, so like, so to be fair, I, I misunderstood streaming when I saw it, when I saw it, because it's, it's not about being good at Blood Bowl. But I thought, you know, uh, or explaining what you're doing. So I thought I'll be good at Blood Bowl and explain what I'm doing and that'll help people. And then at some point I lost that and then turned into just being a dickhead all the time. Which is what most streamers do, isn't it? I'm a lovely fella, dog to the dog, believe it or not. You're the best. Oh, thanks, Dave. <laughs> You're all idiots, no offence. Well, it is no offence. No, I didn't call them idiots. I said they were all terrible at Blood Bowl, and they were, right? Stripping and Crendor would tell you they're rubbish at Blood Bowl, wouldn't they? Sure they would, and obviously they don't care. They obviously don't care about how rubbish they are at Blood Bowl either, you know. Does their, does their life improve in any way at all if they get better at Blood Bowl? No. <laughs> Streaming isn't 75% looks. Wah, get out of town, dog to the dog. That's completely untrue. It actually is hard, Pedro, believe it or not. Believe it or not. <laughs> hey, Caleb. I mean, I don't know if that's meant to be a compliment, because, I mean, I know I'm a handsome bastard, so I guess thanks, Dog, to the talk. Ooh, what do we do here? Do we, uh, do we blitz the ball? Yes. Ooh, it's a lot of players, though. I mean, this is so good. I'm gonna do it. One in thirty six sucks, doesn't it? Just bring him back. Cover. Okay. So this is pretty nice, isn't it? We push him to here. And then the guard comes in and pushes him out to here. Gives us this hit here. Which fails. Which works. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five. Easy. 
Christ. That was a pretty good turn, wasn't it? That was a pretty good turn. Well done, Jim. Ooh, done it in three turns as well. So we might be able to go for a 4 nil here, if we're really lucky. <laughs> also, this is the one on 13, tactically positioned to be, uh, to be the one who scores. Glorious. Thanks, Kilo. That was pretty good, wasn't it? Using the, using the like you know the guard for the second hit to fill the things to get the thing to get the assist. This was a bit safe. This was a bit safe as well. Obviously, the edge five could have assisted there, and then the pop, the, pop, the hit on the ball would have been then being with Pom. Uh, but obviously, having the edge five for the recovery is good, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, Pedro. Yeah, good one. Why has he got three arms? There's a there's a bit of a there's a bit of a reason, Timmy, in a in a in eternal league like this, right? There is actually a there is actually an upside to to extra arms. Now, obviously, the answer is he's new is the answer, but it does help you farm SPPs, <laughs> whereas sure hands doesn't. <laughs> So it's got something going for it. Frustration both down? No. I might I might have gone for the frustration both down <laughs> if I was him. <laughs> Taking three cars up or failing. Hardly getting any knockdowns. I mean, is it great for him? <laughs> Being 150 TV down to a team stacked with dodge when he's hardly got any block. And... Alright, it's good that he's not frustration both down. I mean... <laughs> I mean, frustration moves are rarely good, are they, dog to the dog? I don't think people like frustration moves. I don't think uh, people look back on games and say, oh, I'm really, really proud of this play when I was so fucking pissed off I did something wrong. <laughs> but it's understandable. Like, it's understandably pissed off with this game, right? Like, my team stacked, dodged nearly everyone. And he's got basically skillless team. Fucking chaos who was shit. He's got a shit team without skills, and I've got a great team with skills. <laughs> and and I've removed a quarter of his team, more than a quarter of his team. <laughs> so yeah, it's pretty stupid. It's pretty flippin' stupid. I would forgive anybody uh, making frustration plays right now. One, mm, one, two, three, four. No, I can't get around for that. I could three D. I mean, I wouldn't, I wouldn't. I disagree completely, Kalon. Fair enough if they were like even teams, right? But they're not. So it's just uh, unenjoyable getting your shit pushed in for 16 turns. Especially where the dice have gone, right? The fact that I've made the Kaz as well. Like, if he had made three removals on me, then uh, the game could go very differently, couldn't it? Oh wow, he's leveled. Oh yeah, because he did the pass. Duh. I thought I thought I'd scored on a lineman somehow. Right. 
Ricky Cairns vs. Dills. <laughs> Start as a champ and default into a complete Budweiser mongrel. <laughs> Amazing. I mean, yeah, I guess there's there's tiny, there's like only small things you can learn, though, right? You can learn so much more with like a match where you've got a chance. <laughs> like if he's the Dark Elves and I was the Chaos, I feel like he could have learned, you know, he would have had the opportunity to learn a lot more, you know? Yeah, to each their own is a. It's a good thing to say when someone's wrong. Or when you're wrong in Kalon's case. <laughs> Out of vanity pass. <laughs> Fuck up, <dude. laughs> This is like a chunter coaching session. To be fair, this is a chunter coaching session, yeah. <laughs> That's great, dude. Oh, I've forgotten about my uh, forgotten about my Marvel Snap. This is a oh, I won a game with Marvel Snap. <laughs> it's so funny, honestly. Right? There's a there's a character in Marvel Snap called Agatha Harkness, and she plays your deck for you. So you now I finally got her. I didn't have her for ages. And now I finally got her. So you just literally press play and then check your phone like five, six minutes later or something or seven minutes later and then you've, you've either won or you've lost and you've like, you've got boosters for playing. And I just, so I just, I just had my phone on all day. All day on Marvel Snap. <laughs> and just, uh, God knows how many games I've played. Well, not played, like, the, you know, the, the game plays in for you. It's brilliant. He didn't qualify. Jesus Christ, how did he not qualify? That is unbelievable. Oh, he's qualified then, he'll qualify. Yeah, the game plays itself. You just literally start the game and then check at the end. Yeah, he'll definitely qualify. Yeah, but not in yet, Dimmy. When half of the people who've qualified don't take their ticket, he'll be in. <laughs> yeah. No, no, still no one cares and stuff. I didn't care for five hundred dollars. <laughs> Let me play Blood Bowl. Oh, yeah, massive raid though from Elliot, wasn't it? Massive raid from Elliot. Elliot got me the views on that fumble spell. Not me or fumble. <laughs> Just Elliot. Elliot or. Right. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, GFI. I'm not going to go down there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, GFI. I can hit this turn. Just whether it's worth it, right? Is it worth it? It's probably better to pawn this guy and just tap the ball. Nice. 
Christ again. Three things. Yeah, farming for when you do play. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I'm farming for when I do play. Send me a dick pic. Oh, I'll have to have a look then. I mean, that's not concurrent, Dimmy. <laughs> What does that mean? It just to total viewers right over the entire over the entire stream total. Yeah, uh, I think it's unique viewers. I think it's unique viewers. I believe it's unique viewers. That one is. No, a current prisoner. See, con current. <laughs> mm. This is a bit shit, isn't it? This witch elf can be. It is, but it was a long stream, right? It was a long stream. And uh, got the Elio trade. Help me, Bodger. Outrageous. Are you going to go in there? We could just uphill this. bit shit but uh it's like <laughs> the least effort way of doing it you basically have to appeal it Means we haven't got the edge five for the pick for the uh, for the recovery is the bad thing. <laughs> Fail the one in nine anyway. I guess he's got to come in. Safe moves first, look. Four. Now we just have to pow anyway. Oh, it pushes the same.
This is a bad thing. Like, it took so much resources to get hit doing it this way. Ugh. Flippin' diced. Yes, no follow to not catch. Yep, thank you, Kerlon. I mean, also, right, he gets into danger if he follows. Like, if I don't break AV, he just gets punched instantly. So, that that's that's a bigger consideration than not than the not catching. If it was a blodger, I would have probably followed. Um, but I don't want to get punched. <laughs> Much bigger concern than catching. He's getting punched. Best players have to not be punched. Probably Kale on, yeah. Probably. Maybe jump up though, maybe jump up, tackle, dodge. Jump up, tackle, dodge is pretty tempting to be honest. It's probably like 4-4-4 four, 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 Steve. Oh, there's six, there's six tiers on I thought there were, for some reason, I thought there were three tiers. So is there six tiers? Man, I've really got to stop winning at some point. <laughs> Oh, is it Unforgiven Ireland? I thought it was like in real life. <laughs> it's not a joke, it's just what I thought. Oh my god, he won D pals me. Get out of town. Get out of town. This is tricky, isn't it? You could punch him, and that gets the guard in. And it doesn't, yeah, it doesn't have power. One, two, three, four, five, six, no. It'd be power there. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five, five. No, we can move this guy first. And then one, two, th three, four. No, it doesn't work, does it? Could punch him. That's pretty tempting. Yeah, okay, that's probably better. No, 
Uh, the bad thing is this commits him unless I block here. So let's block here first. He's got dodge. A blockless block. Diced again. Really bad committing large five. I would love that. Could scatter the ball, but it's very likely it gets caught. Got in the way of my uh, move here, didn't I? Double GFI? I mean, I haven't got a reroll anyway, so this is the same as add GFI. So, but I can't die on this. I've got an apple. Probably shouldn't have risked a guard dying, should I? I mean, that was definitely the wrong play. Now that I think about it, that was just definitely the wrong guy. That was just definitely the wrong player. Thinking, pfft, I've got an apple was really stupid, wasn't it? That was really stupid. Wow, that was really dumb. There's, what, a 30% chance to roll a one? And then whatever chance there is to die, nap or fail, there's just no point. Get, give it the witch who can then pass it. Or we'll score herself. Really, Kalon? Wow. Don't tell PC. <laughs> <laughs> the last thing he wants is someone else to talk. <laughs> Oh, d don't worry, Unforgiven. You won't get the chance to get going. <laughs> oh, it powers. Powers me, Blodger. Diced. Yeah, I shouldn't have... Uh, I shouldn't have used him, I guess. I should have just uh, committed the guard in there. And then I would have had the Edge 5 for recovery. So I'd have still failed the score, but at least I wouldn't have 
near the GFI, but I should have just let him in this thing. So dumb. Uh, it, with a reroll, I guess I should have done the cheat first with a reroll, but without a reroll, it's not worth the guard of dying to maybe get four SPP. Oh no, he didn't fire I didn't think he'd bother. Did not think he would bother. Keep him safe. Run away. Clear a pass action. Oh, I don't have to because it's not a shit game. Catch it, Flicky. Lad. Ooh, he could score. So we've got a screen for the pummel. The guy. And they've screened the dodger. Do I go for the pass without a reroll? Probably not, eh? I was never trying to lose Big Chi Chi. I can't help myself. I can't help myself. But yes, definitely trying to maximise SPP. Which is why I said I'll probably go for the 3 0 win. Which I did. But you know, you just, you just gotta. You've always got to play at the maximize of PP, haven't you? Actively throwing is to usually be encouraged. <laughs> but I just. I just hate that. That's true. Intend to not do it. I mean, it's actively better to lose in in almost every in almost every league. It's better to lose the first season, right? and it gives you easier season two. Mm, didn't protect him enough. And now he gets to. Foul him as well as bits. to hurt him. And he's cast. Wonderful. Miss next. And miss next. Brilliant. Fantastic. Last hit of the game. <laughs> Fuck's my next one. Woo! Blood ball. you got to love it. But you don't have to love it. 
What you probably should do is hate it and not play it. Make a sense of it first. I guess that last guy that went over there should have like GFI'd back over here to screen the screen. I want to GFI. Um. Right. So 30% of the time I get nothing, versus 70% of the time I get four, or I get three 100% of the time. So it's basically nine versus eight, isn't it? Hmm. But he shouldn't have been hit, and uh, I shouldn't have GFI'd. By him. Anyway, what was the SPP like? 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 23. Pretty good. Um, and obviously he didn't die, which is good. Pogla got MVP, good. Another another level. Sidestep. Really sad to miss the Palmer. He could have leveled next match. Good chance of leveling in this match, next match, if he'd been playing, but never mind. Can get a 12th man, 13th as it would be. Um, so, yep, pretty nice. Top of the league! Woo! It was week 10 against. Live fast. Elven Union. Don't have a Pommer against Elven Union. Ugh, diced. You could have slaughtered the whole team. And then Wood the Bad and the Ugly is the last one, which is Wood Elves. So yeah, Elven Union and Wood Elves. The last two. Two of the top teams are very interesting. So there you go. Right, thanks for watching everyone. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and stay fantastic.